What is the deal, YouTube? Man, this is your boy Hollywood Troy. I am finally back with yet another video, you guys. And like today, we're gonna have a review and an on foot of the recently released Air Jordan 12 Low Super Bowl. Let's get it. Yes, yeah, so we do have the Air Jordan 12 Low, man. The Low Super Bowl, man, just released. I just got them today. Actually, I just picked them up today. And the shoe is looking very nice. Love the material. The material looks great. I love it how it feels. I love the confetti. A lot of people have mixed feelings about the confetti. I really don't have a problem with it. I like it. It looks nice. Love the heel tab, man. I had to put the orange on the heel tab. And I love the gold accents that they put on this shoe. The uppers. Love the uppers, man. So we are about to dig into this shoe. So the first thing I am going to talk about on this shoe is the uppers part, man. That kind of it reminds me of a... I want to say pants material for some type of reason, man. They got that, like, black sort of, uh, should I, should I say 501 pants type of material, 501 Levi, something like that. I don't, I don't want to, like, talk about far shoe materials that much. I'm not that accurate on far as talking about that right there. The, uh, the lowers, the mids, man, uh, the mids, you know, got that, that young, uh, flu game vibe right there with the leather, with the red. Got that young flu game vibe looking pretty nice, man. I did notice like glue marks. I don't know if you guys can see it, probably like about right here. Some uh glue marks on the shoe. Uh that kind of be kind of typical when you get 12s and stuff. So as far as like I think of my is it the hyper royals that came out like about a year or two ago? The black and blue ones. I seen a lot of glue marks on those. And I wanna say the reverse uh the reverse taxis, I think, had it as well. I got those as well. And I think there was like a lot of glue marks. It's always like a lot of glue marks typically around here, around the, uh, on the mid area, man. So I don't see that much on this one, but I do see some glue marks on here. Now, if I have both shoes in hands, uh, like I said, the shoe is actually, it looks pretty nice, man. I don't really see nothing bad about the shoe. I love the material. I love what they did. I love the cuts that they did on the shoe. The uh, only problem is just, yeah, probably just about the glue mark. I don't see much glue marks on this shoe right here. It looks pretty nice, man. Like I said, I just got them, and I just wanted to hurry up and drop this video off for you guys, man. So the shoe actually is pretty nice. I love it. I can't wait to even rock these, man. I think some good, some good fits uh, together with these right here. Like I said, I don't really have a problem with the confetti. The confetti looks great to me. I love the gold accent. The gold accent plays off well on this type of shoe right here. Okay. We all know by now the box comes in a uh, typical looking Jordan 12 box and stuff that it has that confetti design going throughout the shoe. You guys see that uh, number 9 right there, that size 9 right there, size 9. What does the box say? The box says Air Jordan 12 Low SE, Black Varsity Red, uh, Varsity Road. There you have it. Uh, USB 190, suggested retail, size 9, you guys. So, yeah. Nothing really typical on the inside. Normal inside. Like I said, just come with the confetti box. Nice confetti around the, uh, the shoe box itself. Looking nice. So, my overall honest opinion of this shoe, it is a great shoe. I think that I'm kind of, I might want to say that I'm glad that I chose this over the recent release of uh, Chinese New Year's, which I was going to get, but I didn't end up buying them because... It's just the Chinese New Year's, man. I didn't like it that you can see through the shoe and see, like, the, the pattern that they had behind the shoe. Somewhat like this one. Like, people, I hear people saying that this one actually supposed to have, like, the confetti design throughout the whole entire upper part of the shoe. Like, you can probably rip it apart. I'm not going to destroy mine because I'm planning on keeping this one right here. So, I will not destroy mine myself. So yeah, I mean, if you guys want to just go ahead and destroy your shoes and just check it and see, more power to you. Even if you want to send it to me so I can do it for you guys, and please let me know in the description, man. Comment, hey, uh, however you guys want to send me the shoe, just send me the shoe and I'll do it for you guys. If not, then, oh, I mean, do it yourself. So once again, guys, man, this is a very, very great shoe. Are y'all happy with the design, happy with the quality? It looks great, man. It looks pretty awesome. And I am glad to be producing this video for you guys so you guys can see this shoe in hand. And of course, I'm going to hit you guys with an own foot. 
after the video so you already know the deal stay tuned for that and that's it everybody man this is your boy hollywood try i am about to check up out of there man but i'm glad you guys and hopefully you guys enjoyed this video i hope you guys did hope you guys like this video and subscribe if you are new to watching this video and all my old subscribers man hope you guys like this video and enjoy this video i just produced for you guys man this is your boy hollywood i am about to be up before i do don't forget to hit that like if you have it don't forget to subscribe if you have it and you can always check out all my other social medias, man. Hit me up, man, you guys. And chat with your boys sometimes, man. I'm always open to chats. Doesn't matter when, what time. Just hit me up. Uh, if I don't respond, most likely I'm asleep or doing something else. But 9 out of 10, I might respond. And I will be going live on Twitch. Uh, I try to do it Saturdays. I don't know about Sundays. So probably this Monday, you guys. This Monday, uh, 6 Pacific time or Western time. I should be live on my Twitch, you guys. So just check in, man. Tune in with your boy. I might be showing uh probably Cyberpunk in the beginning. That's probably about the only thing. Cyberpunk, probably some a uh, little bit of Battlefield. I don't have the new Call of Duty because I don't know, man. It's just a lot of stuff going on with Call of Duty. I just, yeah, maybe I jump in it anyway. This your boy Hollywood, man. You guys, I am out. You guys be safe out there. I love you guys. Thanks for watching, and I hope you guys enjoy. Peace.